Hey guys, another right Dev here. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a simple mine. So basically how it works, if you step on it and it explodes and you die of course, and then the mine is destroyed just like this. So you step on it, and you can see the mine disappears because, well, it's, you blew it up and you, I died of course. And in the end, I even showed you guys how to make a, a reusable mine that doesn't disappear. So you can see it stepped on it, it's still there, and then I can step on it again. So they're basically uh, the same thing, um, but this one has like one different line of code and that's it. Um, there's only 10 lines of code, really, really simple. And it's nine lines of code if it doesn't um, explode. So if you guys are excited, leave a like and subscribe. We're so close to 200 subscribers. Thank you guys so much for all the support on the channel. And I'll see you guys in the video. Bye. All right, guys. I'm in my base right now, as you can see. And the first, um, the first thing we're gonna go ahead and do is actually create our little mine. We're gonna step on it. And it's gonna explode. Um, so I'm just gonna make a very simple mine. So let's go ahead and speed this up. Okay, right, guys. So I have my little mine set up here. It's kind of kind of bright. Um, let's set the metal, I guess. There we go. Oh, there you go, I have my little mine set up, and uh, I'll just go ahead and create it into a union, so it's one part, and then um, I can rename it to um, mine, I guess, and uh, anchor it, of course, there we go, um, so now what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to script the mine to blow up and if you step on it. But right now you can go ahead and step on the mine and absolutely nothing would happen. Now what we're going to do to make it explode when we touch it is we're going to um, we're gonna have to script it. So we can go ahead and add in a script to the mine. Just like that. You can delete the hello world. And we're going to create a function. A script dot parent dot touch and connect function and then you can go ahead and set function to hit all right now what we're gonna do is we're gonna check if it's a player touching the part so if um hit dot parent um colon find first child and then we're gonna do humanoid then just like that and you can hit enter. So if it's a player that touched the part, we're gonna make it explode. So local explode uh, is going to be equal to instance dot new. And we're gonna create an explosion, of course. And then we can set the parent of the explosion with a comma and um, script dot parent, just like that. So down here we can do explode we could set the value of the explosion so explode um dot position would be equal to script dot parent dot position and you want to make sure that the position is set to the mine because if it's not then it'll just explode in the center of the base plate and that's not really helpful unless your mine is at the center of the base plate so um yeah all right, so now what we can do is explode um, the last pressure is going to be equal to um, 500 for now. You can set to whatever you want and explode um, uh, last um, radius is going to be equal to 10. And then we can do wait one. And we can do, uh, and then once it's exploded, we can destroy the mine because, well, the explosion would have blown it up. So we can do script dot parent um, colon destroy. As you can see now, if I go ahead and step on the mine, oof, explosion, and the mine is destroyed, of course, because uh, the um, because it blows up and it, it gets destroyed. <laughs> If you want the mine to be reusable, then you can just get rid of this line right here. And then when you step on it, you'll be able to step on it all over again. 
see it and it's still there and then you can go ahead and step on it again and so if you just destroy that last line you can use it over and over again um but if you're making it realistic then you should probably add in um uh the last line but yeah guys if you guys enjoyed this video and it was helpful to you uh be sure to leave a like and subscribe hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload um thank you guys so much for watching we're so close to 200 subscribers uh be sure to subscribe and see you guys in the next video bye